Okay, guys, this is a review of the Warrior One L96 OD, which is basically crap for green. Uh, comes stock with the uh, cheap folding bipod and 3 to 9 by 40 scope. Uh, decent scope, it lasted quite a while. And basically, for my full review on this, go look at the um, UTG L96 review. Basically, these guns are virtually the same, except for a few small details, which I'll show you now. The barrel on the Warrior One L96 is actually tons, tons smoother. It's like, wow, they must have um, like filed it down or just done some really good wash job on this thing because it's like, it's super smooth. Unlike the L96 and the the uh, G22, it's like, wow, this thing is um, amazingly smooth. Also, just the same as the UTG one, it has the little orange plug over it. I wouldn't even call it a plug, it's more like a, um, it's like a cap almost that's glued on. I'd suggest taking that off or just painting over it. Okay, we're going to go ahead and shoot this now at camo once again at 50, 100, and 150 feet. Camo, it's about 50 feet away out there. See, of oh, course, yeah. once you say that, they think it's going to be your name. Okay, he's been given the thumbs up to turn around so we can shoot him. Gun has been bolted and firing. Perfect hit in the back. Super silent weapon, as you can tell. Another good hit in the back, left shoulder blade. Left arm, decent hit. Okay, he's been given the thumbs up to turn around. Go ahead and bolt the weapon. Weapon's been bolted. Stop shooting, will you guys? Yeah, we got some other guys shooting some guns here, so. Hey, go ahead and fire. It's at 100 feet also. You can see the weapon went down Stop shooting, slightly. Blake. Wow. Gee. Nice shot. <laughs> Not really. You missed. Another shot. Wasn't me though. Perfect shot in the back. 100 feet. This gun is still accurate. Same hit in the back. Perfect shot. Okay, he's 150 feet away now. Been given the thumbs up to turn around. It was camouflage. Weapons and bolted and firing. Good hit in the back. First shot is a hit. Looks a little low to me. It's a good hit though. Another hit. Right side, a little low. Still a hit. Three hits right in a row. As you can tell, this gun is super accurate. I swear, if you got a tight bore barrel for this thing, you could probably hit someone at 200 feet easy. Okay, I'm Prodigy from Airsoft Team Kilo 23. Thanks for watching.